Hi guys, we're still under the topic of social issues. In this video, we'll be looking at alternative lifestyles. Now, first we need to ask, um, what is alternative lifestyle? Now, alternative lifestyle can be defined as a lifestyle lived by people out of a societal norm. Right or out of societal norms, whether to an extreme or moderately. Right? Now, making an alternative lifestyle choice simply means choosing to live all or part of life outside what might be, um, you know, considered to be societal norms, right? As I said before. These norms are also subject to changes from influences within society and what was once considered alternative may become mainstream, like today's day. Now, next we'll be looking at things we consider to be alternative lifestyle. Now, first we'll be looking at the use of herbal medicines instead of traditional medicines, right? No, the use of herbal medicines instead of traditional medicine is really because um, persons who tend to, you know, not taking a lot of pills, maybe what the doctor has prescribed, they tend to, you know, believe that, you know, the herbal medicine, you know, have more me medicinal value um, to their, 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 their bodies, right? And they tend to just lean to herbal medicine alone. You understand? And not use traditional medicine that is like prescribed by um <clears throat> by their doctors right now secondly we have choosing to live in the woods instead of um within a community no this is also an alternative lifestyle no you might find persons, um, people may choose to, you know, lead a very simple life, um, shunning a normal path of career development, money earning, and acquisition of positions, right? Now, these persons are persons you'll find leaving all these things behind to, you know, live alone in the wilderness and not socializing with anyone, right? Now, we'll be looking at the third one, which is Types of unions, example, polygamous cult. Now, this is somewhat, you know, living with, um, living in the woods, but somewhat, you know, like they're, they're instead of, instead of, um, instead of going off by themselves, they're in a cult with other persons who um with like minds they like forsake um forsake normal well what we'd call normal people living in society right they have the same mindset and so they live together right normally and then we have others like it's not listed here but we have um other stuff like you know persons choosing to live with um the same gender right um have them as their partner that is also an alternative lifestyle like two females living together um as lovers and also two males so yes that's also an alternative lifestyle things out of the norm or societal norm right it's not listed here but that's also alternative lifestyle now next we'll be looking at how does alternative lifestyle affects society first communication communication is very very important right now because um depending on how um and how extreme the lifestyle choices um issues may arise regarding how these persons and society relate now, communication, as I said before, it's very important. And if persons do not communicate with each other, then they are back in like cave, caveman days. You understand? So communication is very important. So being a part of society is also, um, communication is also a part of society, being a part of society. Right? So 
if you isolate yourself and take yourself up in the woods, which is um, a part of, um, which is a part of an alternative lifestyle, you don't want to socialize. So that's a that's a that's a big no no. That's a problem, right? So it's very important for a person to communicate. Second, we have um, law and order, right? We might say all citizens have rights, such as access to education and health services. All citizens also have responsibilities, such as contributing to the economy and paying taxes. Now, most persons um, might take themselves, and I think that's a bit selfish, where they take themselves and maybe isolate themselves, um, maybe up in, as I said before, the woods, and they don't socialize with anyone at all, they don't deal with society any at all, right? And therefore, um, what would society, because society um, is run under law and order, right? So taxes are supposed to be paid also, and they, and they can do anything while they're up there by themselves. They can you know, kill anyone, they don't, they have no regulation, right? No form of regulation. So they are living by themselves, they are not a part of society, so that can cause a problem to society. Because they can come back in society, but not of be, um, being not of society, right? Hope I'm not confusing you guys. Now, third, taxation. As I said before, Taxation is very important. If you're not a part of society, um, then it's it's highly unlikely that you follow the rules of society, which is um, a part of it is um, paying your tax, right? Now, moving on to social cohesion. No, social co um, social cohesion is um is defined as the willingness of members. Of a society to cooperate with each other in order to survive and prosper. No, this is really cooperation, and if you're not living with within um society, then it's very difficult for you to, you know, learn how to cooperate with persons and live together and know that you cannot do this and and you can't do that. You have to live uh, under law and order. So, really and truly, um, cooperating is very important to society. And as I said before, if you're not a part of society, then this can pose a problem. Right? So, that's it for now, guys. But, um, as a matter of fact, I should tell you guys, you could um, look out for my other video coming. Um, it's going to be on suicide, right? And please, guys, subscribe. Or if you do not subscribe, you cannot see any of my videos. You will know when I put out a new video. So, guys, it would be nice if you could just press that subscribe button. And, you know, do, your, do yourself and others some good because you won't know when... Um, if these videos are helpful to you, then you need to know when another one comes out. So, subscription is the only way to do that. To ensure that you get these videos on time and all those other stuff, right? Now, guys, thanks for watching. And those who have subscribed to me, thank you very much. Um, I, I hope um, this is helpful to you. And if it has been helpful to you, then you can probably give me a thumbs up and you can also comment down below. Alright, thank you. Bye-bye.